migrants are still prepared to risk their lives on small boats. In the migrant camps in northern France, it's Mother Nature that calls the shots. Immigration Processing Center at Port of Dover Many of the people staying in makeshift tent villages are waiting to catch small boats to the UK. In the migrant camps in northern France, migrants determined to reach UK view on watch today, it's the weather which has disrupted some of those crossings rather than an announcement from Westminster. I'm going because because they give us free stuff. Like most of the refugees and migrants we meet, he's unaware of the planned crackdown. If you go on the small boats, you could die, and if you get caught in the UK you could get deported and never be able to go back, will you still try? I ask. Yes, he replies, I'm fed up. Of living in the camp. We get free hotel and food in the UK. The perilous channel crossing is often the final leg of a long journey. Some have come through five countries to get here on their way to the boats but like 19-year-old Afghan, Jaber, they won't give up on their UK dreams. If they send us away we will come back, he says. And if they send me to Rwanda, I haven't committed a crime, so I will come back.